prepare the XML file. We start with the request queue. Then we have the saved queue. We have the floating action button. So in the code, we have to define in fragment binding the local helper class queue item, the queue adapter. We have the saved items, saved request adapter, and the request status class. Local database on create view to inflate our fragment uh, XML file, which we are using fragment binding, the returning slot. All right. Next, we define on a view created method so that you can do our work from here. All right. So in this method, utilizing our helpers, utilizing our database, initializing our request queue and the uh, uh, adapter, also initializing our saved recycle view and the uh, adapter, our action buttons like the uh, action floating button, then uh, saving status so after all that now we can run our application so waiting for it all right so this is an auto usd app like that so allow usd auto to make calls and manage defaults on this device Click allow. So to get started, you have to click uh, on uh, this button, floating action button. 